Hello, this is the RPG Crawler, and welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Redemption. It has been a rough week as far as I'm concerned, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift some stuff around. Uh, I need to get this guy, like, something with a... something with some sort of accuracy bonus. Probably going to sell this, sell this. Going to keep this for emergencies. I have no idea what that scroll is. I'm gonna try and sell that at some point. Oh no, I gotta. There, I gotta shuffle this stuff around. I don't think that I can sell this to Yolnorna. Trying to remember where I, where I was because I've had a rough couple weeks. Let me distribute these vials of blood. Yeah, she needs to drink, and he needs to drink. I basically need to stock up on vials of blood, so, uh, let's do it. I might have to go sell some of this stuff at the, uh, at the smiths, too. Alright. Can't sell that, can't sell that. I can sell this, which is, it's basically poisoned blood. Pretty sure I can't do my- oh. I can get blood magic with that. Um, yeah, let's get another vial of blood. Farewell, young and then distribute these a little bit more. Gotta really stock up on this stuff, don't I? She's gotta get filled up, and so does uh, our, our boy Willem. Wilhelm, whatever. Get everybody topped up and then buy as much blood as we can. Hello, young one. I got she just has. Is it you decide? Whole vials of blood in stock. Oh no, I'm out of, I'm out of money. But I gotta go sell oh, some more of those, God, some more of those items. Yeah, maybe one more on Wilhelm, or two more on Wilhelm. There we go. Let's go find the smith and sell some of our gear, uh, so that we can go ahead and. And get stocked up for the return back into into the tunnels. Yeah, it has been it has been a rough couple weeks since I've recorded this, so I'm trying to remember where I even was. I think we were down dealing with the Tremere in the uh, in the uh, uh, the alchemist or the apothecaries or whatever uh, layer, if I remember right. See if I can remember how to get to the smith from here. I think those just turn right, right? Maybe not. That's cool. Whatever. Oh wait, yes it was. It was right. Now, I'm doing all my selling on Kristoff, uh, because I believe he has the highest... See, look at this. Because he has the highest uh, in terms of... Uh, In terms of the ability to do stuff, so this guy will buy it for 101, Kristoff will buy it for 95, so that tells me he's got the best chance of dealing with shopkeepers. Let's sell this stuff. Do I need to sell any more weaponry? I think I'm good on the weaponry. Good day to you. So we can go back into the tunnels now. And it's just along the Judith Bridge, right? Yeah, there we go. All the way back. <coughs> just a long walk away. Oh, 
hopefully I won't get uh, too robbed of uh, good gear because of my uh, lack of desire to continuously reload. I've had a lot of people chiming in with useful information uh, since I last recorded, so I'm going to try to implement some of that. The whole problem is going to be um, whether or not I remember half of it. Let's look at the quests. So I've got to invade the Tremere Chantry. I've got to continue doing that, basically. I'm going... I'm probably sounding really distant because I'm on a different setup than usual. I'm trying to actually physically move my, my recording station closer to myself. That'll do it. It'll also help me see in this darkness. Wow, it is dark in here. Trying to remember where I go here. Got to remember not to get everybody caught up on that corner there. There was a passage down here, right? If I remember right. Wasn't there? Am I, am I going the wrong way? I think I'm going the wrong way. It's in here, right? At the very far end over here? Yeah, here we go. Down into Arden's Chantry 2. God, I'm trying to remember where to go. Come on, move out of my way. Oh, come, come on, move out of my way. Thank you. I say thank you, but she never actually moved out of my way. I just walked around her. Gotta love the pathfinding in this game. Hold on. There's something I can smash back here. Greek fire. I need to save the game. Just in that interim save slot that I've been using. I think this is roughly where I was when everything... when I, when I had to sign out last time. Yeah, because I'd rescued these people, and then I was supposed to go further down. Well, let's see where we can go from here, shall we? If I remember right, this dude was rescued from a cavern down here? Oh, God. I remember this. This was, this was like a little miniature hell in here, trying to deal with all this stuff. Now it's coming back to me. We had that big room with a root. So now I just gotta find the, uh... I think it's over here, isn't it? Yeah, this is down to Chantry 3. Yeah, this is where I had to come back to. Because I was completely out of supplies. Now I'm somewhat less out of supplies. I'm broke, but... Not so much out of supplies. <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, all the way down to Arden's Chantry 4 already. I have not been down here. Try and try and get them to come over at me. There's Ardan himself. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll save the game real quick. And then I guess come in after him. Do not attack me! I shall give thee all thy desires! Hold, Ardan. I am Christoph Romuald of Clan Bruja. Where is Aneska? 
Welcome, Christoph Ramuald. Ah, yes. An intriguing woman came unto me. A nun she was. And she was my first nun. Uh, that is, she was the first nun who ever came seeking me. Hmm. Aneska, her name. She sought the lore of the kindred. She sought our secrets. And she sought to learn of thee, Kristoff. I was intrigued with such audacity. Come to the point, What Vegas. did you do to her? She seemed to have no fear. No fear at all. I was dumbstruck. She seemed possessed of the courage of a hundred warriors, yet I could smell her fear. Well aware she was of the risk she ran. Was she filled with arrogant self-righteousness? No. She knew her god would not protect her from my hunger. Did she seek martyrdom? No. She clearly clung to her life and lived life with a passion I had not seen before in a nun. Cut to the chase, dude. Was she mad? Or a mere fool? No. Behind her quiet words, there lurked a cunning mind. She was... She was... I did not know what she was. And in not knowing, I was intrigued. Intrigued and... Strangely... Drawn to her. I care not for thy loathsome appetites, Ardan. What became of her? And she was quite beautiful. Didst thou know? Couldst thou see that behind her wimple, that her hair was long and auburn? Couldst thou see that beneath the shapeless folds of her robe, that she possessed a body as achingly beautiful as any odalisque? Truly. She chose the wrong profession to make the best use of the gifts God had bestowed upon her. In defiance of heaven, she had buried her talents in the field of the holy orders. Her beauty transfixed me, just as her courage thrilled me. I don't know if I like where this is going. Like her, and I shall never again. I had to have her. I had to make her my own child. If thou dare to defile her in such a way, I swear, I will burn thee to ash an inch at a time. Thou might show more charity to the only one who can find her. He baits thee, Christoph, and dawdles for some treacherous purpose. Pray, let me kill him! Ardan, if thou dost fail to I just tell met me this where dude, is, and I already like this shapeshifter dude. Eric will behead thee before what, thou gangrel? draw breath again. I know not. I touched her not, but merely sent her away to the Tsumitsi. Dost thou take oh, me so for you a sent fool? Her to the Why wouldst thou send one thou lusted for to thy hated enemy? My sire would not allow me another child, and I dared not defy him. But I could not bear the thought of another embracing her. So I sent her to the Tsumitsi. They are the only clan that would have no use for one such as she. So I could be sure they would not embrace her. They would simply kill her, thinking her a part of some Tremere scheme. Devil-tongued fiend! Yeah, let's rip this dude apart. Sent her to her death. Die. Wait! She did return from the Tsumitsi. What? Liar. The Tsumitsi would have killed her. Peace. Let him speak. I asked her how she survived, and she said, Her faith sustains her in all things. She even thanked me for sending her to the Tsumitsi. Ah, a most remarkable woman. My spies did tell of a premise revenant that did cower before the pure light of her faith, and sobbing like a child, whispered to her of Golconda. Golconda? What is that? The belief that a vampire can be redeemed, cured of the blood of Cain. It is but a legend, and no more, told to give comfort to weak-willed Cainites. Yet no one knows more of Golconda than the great Tremere master, Atreus. She said she would go to him in his chantry in Vienna. She even asked to ride to Vienna in our October caravan of slaves. What a woman! 
really there now, so I guess we got... Well, he just told you, Vienna. Or I will split thee in twain. I delivered her to the Ventru caravan driver, Orsi, and they left three days ago for Vienna. Doc, thou hast enslaved her. Ha! Master Atreus will take great delight in her. And now I have finished casting this spell that will destroy thee, thou love-struck clotpole! Really now, let's, let's tear this dude apart. I will slay thee if it is my last act on Earth! <gasps> Alright, yeah, let's let's go after this dude. Whoop. Uh, you know what I need to do and I need to... Get potence up. Get celerity up. Get blood healing up. Come, we return to the university in triumph. Barely had enough time to buff. But then okay. I shall go to Vienna and reclaim fair Aneska from these cursed warlocks. Yeah, we need to do that. Okay, so I knew I learned a new discipline group, Auspex. So I've got presence, I've got protein, I've got potence. Fortitude, celerity. Aspects. It gives me heightened senses. I kind of need that. You know, if I get five more wits, I can learn uh, Thaumaturgy. Which I'll do. I, I do want heightened senses. I need to boost manipulation. I need to boost, uh, what is it, dexterity? I'm hit okay for now. <laughs> you will learn dexterity. <clears throat> Maybe some stamina? I don't know. Oh, what do you get, Wilhelm? <sighs> Presence. Maybe Cloak of Shadows? And we'll get another Celerity. Uh, Serena, you're the Cappadocian. You get... Dexterity. We'll give you... Oh. Uh, we'll go ahead and get Shambling Hordes up again. Maybe Vigor Mortis will give you Torch and Fireball. Like, Fireball was just the ones that the Tremere were, were, were dumping on me. Maybe Flame Ring. No, I can't do Flame Ring. Alright, and then Eric, you're the Gangrel. Yep, dang. Um, get your dexterity up to 50. Give you Shape of the Beast. Alright, but before I do anything, let's let's take a look at the... the Tome of Thalmaturgy. So I gained Blood Magic. Alright. So what's blood magic do for me? Nothing just yet, right? I guess not. Uh, let's talk to Ekaterina. I must take my leave of this city. I am sure the Tremere hold Aneska in their Vienna Chantry. I can no longer continue here while she remains in danger. Ardan was a consummate deceiver. The I didn't Tremere even get a chance to loot Ardan's lair. In Vienna, and we are not ready for bloody battle with the usurpers. They invited thee to play a sinister game. They know that one day we will have to attack their Vienna Chantry, and so they desire to force our hand before we are ready. I shall not be tricked. 
Only after we have gathered the other clans in alliance may we contemplate a strike against them. We will not venture into so palpable a trap. But Aneska will die. Yeah. But Aneska will die. Many have died in the Elder Wars, and many more will die ere Gehenna comes. But fewer will die if we bide our time and heed not the trickery of the Tremere. I cannot simply abandon Aneska to those fiends. But I cannot simply abandon Aneska to those fiends? Thou canst and thou must. Thy claim upon her is born in weak need, mortal sentiment. Release such frailties and spare thyself further wretchedness. We cut our ties to mortals when first we received the blessing of All Father Cain. Thou hast been reborn in blood. There's a when lot of dialogue this time. I've been claims, awful quiet. I'm sorry about thou that. Thou art exalted. Thou art immortal. Thou There's art a lot to finally take in free. Um, I thought we Prometheans respect the mortals. I thought we Prometheans respect the mortals. For a bumpkin of a holy warrior, thou dost reason like a Greek sage. Huh. I, we respect mortal men. But we do not seek kinship with the current breed. For lo, these many generations, mortals have been cowed by the cleverness of the Inkanu. Their faculties are thrown by scheming mages, and their wisdom tainted by demons. The little nobility left in them is tainted by corrupt rulers and priests. The mortals of Carthage were worthy companions. Their base progeny are not worth the spilling of the blood of immortals. Aneska is a noble woman as any in Carthage. We must rescue her. Aneska I am is not as noble this one a woman up. as any in Carthage. We must rescue her. Brazen brat! Thou hast earned no such right! Even faithful Wilhelm would quake in fear before making such a selfish request. Perhaps, but I will make it all the same. Perhaps, but I make it all the same. Mayhap, in a generation or two, thou shalt be deemed worthy of making such a request. In a, in a generation or two, she will die an old woman, even if she survives the Siniski. In a generation or two, she will die an old woman, even if she survives the Zemitsi. Then let her die! She chose her path, not thee! She chose to enter the world of vampires. Back and Thou forth. Thou canst not save the foolhardy from their own reckless ways. Remember, like Cain, we are not our brother's keepers. That's rough. I dragged her down his vile pit, and I will drag her back again. I dragged her down this is in vile pit. Giving you all kinds of options I to just abandon her. her. Back again. I forbid it. Tread lightly. Lest thou arouse my anger and provoke my powers upon thee. Do as thou must unto me, but I must rescue her. I know not the fate of my soul, only the state of my heart. Do as thou must, but I must rescue her. I know not the fate of my soul, only the state of my heart. Very well. I see thy heart is fixed upon this course. Yeah, it only took like denied. ten minutes. <laughs> Go if thou wilt. Shouldst thou survive the Tremere trap, remember well this freedom I have bestowed upon thee. Oh, certainly. But I shall not attend this fool's errand. Only a Malkavian would follow thee. Then call me a moon-mad child of Malkav, for I shall go. Wilhelm, thou art a true as friend as any in God's kingdom. Wilhelm, thou art true a friend as any in God's kingdom. A true fool. Mayhap I shall yet see this god of whom thou art overmuch fond. Or mayhap we shall tear the foul halls of the Tremere down around their scabrous ears and bring the black heart of their sire to a Katarina to wear as a charm. Wilhelm, thou art mad! Two Canaanites cannot survive the house to Hexi. Not two, three shall go. You got no power over this dude. No wish to see the inside of another Tremere chantry. I shall discharge my life boon by accompanying the brave Bruja, who pried open in the jaws of the Tremere trap and released poor. Anna. I appreciate this, dude. Where Kristoff goes, Serena goes. Mayhap four shall prevail where one cannot. 
Mayhap I shall have to replace four Prometheans. Come. Wait, are these we two are these Vienna. two Prometheans? All right, well, you know, we're uh, I guess ready to go. I guess let me take a look to make sure there's nothing around here. Like ideally. This means traveling through the Bohemian forest. It is beset with werewolves, mortal enemies of our kind. Few canines survive the road. There so I, I no guess I got my next quest. The beasts while I am near. My clan has made peace with these creatures. We will have safe passage through the forest. Very well. Let us leave by the east gate. Off to the east gate, but first, before I do. I'm gonna head downstairs, and I'm gonna rest up, and I see if I can't uh, gain something else from that, uh, from that, uh, from that thaumaturgy. Let's uh, hit this to rest. All right, let's let's take a look. So thaumaturgy starts with blood rage. Uh, grant blood of potency grants lowered blood cost for discipline usage. Theft of Vitae. Oh yes, I'm gonna take that. Boils the blood of touch target. Oh man, Thaumaturgy has some neat stuff. This requires a minimum of forty intelligence. I've got it. Can't do cauldron of blood though. But here's the thing. No, 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 no. We'll do it. Oops, I should have done more. My bad. Um, Alright, you've still got... Enough to get you some of that. Some of that dexterity. I'm going to pump your dexterity up like 40. Or 45. 44, apparently. And you, you're good. But importantly, now I gotta sort all this stuff out. So I don't necessarily need blood strength, I don't think. Let's get the discipline pain up. I'll get theft of Vitae. That costs 20 blood. I'm not really using all. I could use heightened senses. No, not that. What did I just replace? I just replaced the wrong thing. That was what? Potence? I think I'm good there. How about you? I'll do Shape of the Beast here. See what everybody can do. And I think... Since this now requires me to be out on the road, let, let me get to the gate. I gotta do blood healing. I failed blood healing? We got to go out to the East Gate. And here's the thing. I'm coming up on the end of my time here. Is this the East Gate? Yeah, that's the Vienna. So I'm coming up on my the end of my time here. I'm going to go ahead and call it for the moment. And we'll continue next time. Uh, I know I had a few breaks in there of a minute or two where people were coming and talking to me. But it's good to be back in the game again. And I'm sorry for the quiet. I'm still wrapping my head around all of this information that got dumped on me. This has been the RPG Car with Vampire the Masquerade Redemption. If you like what you've seen, remember to leave a like, comment, and your feedback, and subscribe for more RPG content. Until next time, take care and goodbye.